The St. Sampson Centre is used to offering drinks, snacks and socialising space. But this time, they hosted something special. There hasn't been a wedding at St. Sampson since over 60 years ago. Yet today, John and Chris receive their marriage blessing. Well, it's gone very well and we're so very happy. A lovely service with the Reverend and all the people who've attended have just thought made us feel so good. Feel really, really happy. Just feel very special, just lovely. It's a um, new life, starting a new life together. I think in my case I've found what I think is true lover, that long glass. Uh, I've really had found the lady who really loves me very, very much and I'm so pleased about that. Just so happy, getting really well together. Brilliant. Yeah, it's wonderful, yeah. And for this happy couple, the centre for over 60s was the perfect place to hold such a special event. Well, we came here a few years, two or three years ago on a visit and we've just fell in love with the place, really. The way of life, the way people treat you and uh, respect you and everything else. And uh, we decided it would be an ideal place to get this blessing. If it, it, when it came up, when the chance came up, we just jumped at it. Yeah, Richard asked us and it was a nice honour to be asked. And friends, family and fellow volunteers all came by to visit the bride and groom. It's gone very, very well. Um, Yes, it's uh, fantastic to have uh, a marriage blessing here. Um, there's not been one since 1955, so this is a really big thing for the centre in present day. Um, it's brilliant. Uh, two of uh, two people that come in all the time um, love the centre so much and asked us, you know, can we have a ceremony in the in the church? And we put it to the committee, and they said yes, and it's gone brilliantly. Um, everybody's pulled together. Um, you know, at the start of the day I thought, like, how are we going to make this work with the, the size of the building and the age of some of our volunteers and you know what, it's actually worked so well, really smooth, um, could have gone better actually. And this trend of weddings later on in life may be set to continue. We're all living much longer, there are something like, I don't know, several thousand people, over a hundred now, so I think this is probably sign of the future that people in their 60s who some years ago would have been thought to be you know in the second end and part coming towards the end of their lives are now actually only in middle age and they might well find that they want to uh, remarry yeah so start again and now with the wedding complete the happy couple aren't ready to settle down just yet Benny Dorm on Monday for 10 days and then coming back and getting on with our lives and working at being an happy couple. Get on with it. Getting out, dancing. We love dancing. Everything. We dance anywhere in the street, anywhere at all. We just dance. Mm -hmm. We're driving mainly. We just love it. So now, with the newlyweds jetting off to Spain to celebrate, the St. Sampson Centre looks forward to sharing many happy occasions with others in the future. Aaron Renfrey, That's TV.